Salvation Army asks and people and businesses answer. Details on today's emergency food drive. Up next, tough times and empty shelves. How donations of food can make a big difference in someone's life. And later. As the need for food increases here in Central Ohio, the Salvation Army was faced with empty shelves earlier this week. And today, an emergency food drive held at the Salvation Army Pantry on Main Street brought in tons of donated food, including four tons of tuna, eggs, cheese, and peanut butter delivered from Kroger. And these donations help fill the shelves, but the Salvation Army still needs people to give when they can. NBC4's Rick Reitzel shows us why it matters. Fantastic. Thank you okay, so much. you bet. Really appreciate it. All right. Food yeah. donations came in by the trunk load, but what really made a big difference was this semi filled with food from Kroger. 8,000 pounds of food for needy families. What would you guys do if you didn't have a place like this to come to? I don't know. I really don't know. Terry and her husband are feeding three nephews and three grandkids, and they can't find work. Well, we compared the first six months of this year with the first six months of last year, and we've seen a 34% increase in the number of people coming to our food pantry for help. Professionals out of work, senior citizens, and the chronically poor are consuming more food than the pantry can supply. And this emergency food drive is just a temporary patch for what seems to be a growing problem. They help them get by and everything. They help them get by when food starts getting low. They help them get by, help the people, family, and everything. Else. A family with four kids. And that's why the Salvation Army says this donation from Kroger of tuna, peanut butter, eggs, and cheese is so important for young growing minds. How do you explain to a child when there isn't enough food in the house? We always scrummage up something. I never tell her there's nothing there. We really try to have a selection of healthy things for families, and all different families from different cultures are familiar with different foods, and that's why we have a choice pantry where they can choose something that's familiar to them and they know how to prepare it. The Salvation Army of Central Ohio says produce, garden vegetables, dairy, meat, paper, and canned goods are all welcome donations. In Columbus, Rick Reitzel, NBC4. Thanks, Rick. Don't